According to the biblical book of Samuel, the story of Israel's demand for a king unfolds during a period when the Israelites were led by judges, who served as both military and spiritual leaders. However, the people of Israel began desiring a king to rule over them, similar to the neighboring nations. The story is found primarily in 1 Samuel chapters 8 to 12. The account starts with Samuel, a prophet and judge, who was getting old. Samuel appointed his sons as judges, but they were corrupt and did not follow in his righteous ways. As a result, the elders of Israel approached Samuel and expressed their desire for a king to rule over them. Initially, Samuel was disheartened by their demand, as he interpreted it as a direct rejection of his leadership and of God as their true king. He sought divine guidance, and God comforted Samuel, assuring him that the people's demand for a king was not a rejection of him but rather a rejection of God's rule. Samuel warned the Israelites about the consequences of having a human king. He told them that a king would impose heavy taxes, demand military service, and exploit their labor. However, the people remained steadfast in their demand, insisting on having a king to judge and lead them. Samuel relayed their request to God, who instructed Samuel to anoint a king for the people of Israel. Samuel went on to anoint Saul, a young man from the tribe of Benjamin, as the first king of Israel. Saul was chosen for his physical attributes and seemed to have the potential to be a strong leader. After being anointed as king, Saul witnessed the Spirit of the Lord coming upon him, and he prophesied among a group of prophets. This confirmed his selection to both Samuel and the people. Despite his initial promise, Saul's reign was marked by a series of failures and disobedience to God's commands, leading to God's rejection of him as king. Eventually, David, the youngest son of Jesse, would be anointed as the next king by Samuel, marking the beginning of his rise to power. The demand for a king in the book of Samuel highlights the tension between human leadership and God's sovereignty over the people of Israel. While the Israelites desired a king like other nations, the story also illustrates the potential dangers and pitfalls associated with placing one's trust solely in earthly rulers, rather than in God.